I'm Valder Beebe, host of the Valder Beebe Show. I am famously known for that celebrity interview. Interviews with today's pop icons, movie stars, and celebrities. Tune into our FM radio broadcast and our online broadcast. Visit ValderBBShow.com and SoundCloud.com slash ValderBBShow. I'll see you there. Hi, Valder. Well, good morning, Winnie Sun. Thank you, and welcome to the Valder Beebe Show once again here broadcasting live in Dallas, Texas. I love being here. Thank you. Well, we're so excited to talk with you because you always have good information, and today she wants you, my audience, she said it's time to rethink how you're saving, and she can help you. She's a financial expert. Okay, I thought we were doing good with our savings, Winnie. Well, you know, we could do better because actually the, 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 the numbers show that about 75% of us are feeling stressed out. Pierpoint Financial Survey showed that we feel that we could do better in terms of savings. So I'm here to get you started. All right, because this is America Saves Week, it right? Sure so is. we're going we're gonna to shake them up. That's okay, right. so if, Amer if this is America Saves Week, what does that exactly mean, though? That means this is our chance to all get together and proactively make a decision to get our money working harder. And not only that, to get something set aside for our savings so that at the end of this year, we're all going to look back and be glad that we took action. So they say, Ameri you said Americans aren't saving much. What do, what do you mean by that? Because we're trying to eke out some money. And you know they say we were getting all this money back from the tax uh, plan that they passed. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. Well, it's interesting that you say that, Valder. I mean, we know the economy is doing well, and the market's had its dips, but overall the market's done very, very well. But the, the national personal savings rate is in an, at an all-time low. In fact, the, the lowest it's been since 2005. That means although we might have a little bit more money in our pocketbook, we're not actually proactively saving it. So I actually have three tips that I want to, if, if we have time, I want to share with you on how your viewers can get going right now. Okay, before we get to the three tips, I've got to take this Facebook question because they want to know, as the market, you said you brought this up, kind of, the market is going up, so am I not saving in my 401k? I'm just not personally saving? Well, you are. If you're saving in your 401k, that's great, and that's for retirement, right? But a lot of people aren't even doing what you're doing, meaning they're not even doing the first step, which is to get their savings underway. They might actually keep their money in their pocketbook or in a jar on the kitchen table or in just a standard checking account that isn't even making at least 1%. So you got to make sure that you're, like every penny or every dollar that you have is working hard. And so that's the concept. So I'm glad you're doing the 401k, though. That's that's excellent. All right. Okay. I'm talking to Winnie Sun. We're talking about saving. Okay. Give me those tips, Winnie. Okay. My three power tips. Okay. This is a, these are some of the tips that I actually use for my own clients. So the number one thing, I always talk to my clients about this one. It's automate your savings. Make it so that you don't even have to think about it. Have the money go directly from your paycheck or your checking account right to your savings vehicle. Even if it's $40 a week, by the end of the year, you'll be at over $2,000. Just that alone. The second thing that I want you to do is make sure that you check your statements. Look at how much interest you're making on free cash. For example, if you're not making at least 1% on your money in terms of interest, then go to actually purepoint.com. This is actually Purepoint Financial's website, and they have this really great rate comparison tool that helps you figure out if your money is, it could be making more, right? Could be making more interest. And the third thing you want to do is team up with a professional. So if you're really looking to get serious about your financial plan, your retirement plan, seek out a financial advisor like myself. In the long run, it'll definitely pay off. And if, 
another thing for those of you who are lucky enough to be in Dallas, you know, go to a PeerPoint Financial Center, a, which is in your neighborhood, and you can go in there and talk to a savings professional who can help you kind of make more on your just your 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 day to day money that you have sitting in your checking account. Okay. Final question. Okay. Um, uh, anything else we can do? No. Before I get to final question, anything else we can do to save more? Because saving, as you said, it's a big effort for us. It is. It is. You know, I think it's all in the mindset, right? It's not the easiest thing to squeeze out some money. But take a look at your budget every week. How much are you spending per week, per month? And is there something that you can maybe stop spending on? Maybe you cut out one Starbucks run. Maybe you eat you know, at home an extra time per week and put that money aside. Because at the end of the day, that's money for you. And that will ma really make a difference over time. Okay. Let me ask you, can you tell me a little bit uh, about the advantages of using online banking? Sure, sure. So online banks are really great. I mean, they're hybrid banks, meaning that you can do so much of what you're used to doing in a regular bank online. But the nice thing about having an online bank is they have lower expenses, right? Which translates into more competitive rates for you and I. It's a, it's a, it's a big deal. So you get all that customer service that you're used to, but it's mostly online. And those of you who are in Dallas are super lucky because banks such as Pierpoint Financial actually have these financial centers right in your neighborhood. So you get the best of both worlds. It's a win-win. Winnie Sun is the founder of Sun Wealth Group Partners. Winnie, where can we go online and get more information? Because this has been very life-changing for many of us. <laughs> Thank you. I'm so glad to hear that. Well, you can go to PeerPoint.com. That's a great place for all things savings. And if you want to learn more about me and what I can do for you, you can go to SunGroupWP.com. Well, I think everyone should hire you because you're a smart financial planner, Aww. Winnie Sun. And thanks for gracing the Valder BB Show. Please come back. You know you're always welcome here. Oh, thank you so much. See you soon. Thank you.